<laughs> All right, everybody. Oh, I know some of you might be saying, gee, Nicole, are you ever going to get back around to doing the uh, sauna? <laughs> oh, no, wait. That's Dean. He's asking. <laughs> so we've been busy traveling and oh, just trying to catch up with life and other things. So um, I am about ready to get ready to do, 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 run the... Um, insulation and vapor barrier uh, on the ceiling, but got to run some speaker wire first. Why? Well, because even though you're not hanging out in the sauna for a long, long time, you just might want some chill, relaxing music on. <laughs> so I think what we're going to do is like one of the benches will be over here. So there'll be basically two speakers mounted there. And then what I'm going to end up doing is, bear with me here. Um, just outside the sauna door, um, like the, here's going to be the switch for the light. Somewhere on this wall is going to be where the controls are for um, the actual sauna. And so then also on this wall, I'm going to put a place to basically connect um, audio. So um, probably put a little shelf so we can leave your phone out here out of the, the weather, even though technically they probably would survive the weather. But you shouldn't be playing on your phone when you're trying to chillax in the sauna right right <laughs> so you can put your music on plug it in through here but um i just you know you got to take the opportunity to run all that stuff before you start closing up ceilings because it's just easier that way so that's where i'm at today so my progress for later is going to hopefully be um, some closing up of that ceiling and um yeah don't mind all those wires hanging they're not live just got to pre-run circuits and things like that that you're going to need also. So I always crack up because Dean will come down and be like, are those hot? <laughs> Fun fact, if they're hot, you cap them. You don't, you don't leave them like that. So it's always safer to tape them no matter what in case somebody turns a breaker back on they're not supposed to. Uh, another way you can protect against that, fun fact, is to... Put a piece of tape over that specific breaker in the box, labeling it as staying off. But that's all. <laughs> Randomness. 